The cheap acquisition of $35 million by Liverpool from Brighton is the Premier League's Player of the Year. Mm. Yes, we are referring to the World Cup winning Argentine midfielder Alexis McAllister. McAllister is rapidly becoming one of the best midfielders in the Premier League with consistently invaluable performances. Whether deployed in front of the back four or in a more advanced role, he has been outstanding this season. When Harriet Pryor of Sky Sports questioned Klopp about the Argentine, the manager showered the player with praise for his number 10 jersey, asking, eh, how can you not love a player like him or a boy like him? He's incredible. He's educated in the best possible way. He's really full of life, confident, funny, smart. An incredible footballer. Oh my God, you watch a training session and the coaches look at each other like, wow, what was that? In his last six league games, Mac Allister has contributed four assists and three goals, helping Liverpool through an injury crisis. Now that the Reds are emerging victorious, he is thriving offensively. Klopp has been pleased by more than just his on-field accomplishments. I loved him from the first moment when we met. Before we signed him. I met his dad before we signed him, and the football understanding in his family is obviously second to none. As the exciting 2023-24 season drees to a close and Liverpool reloaded unexpectedly leads the Premier League, it's evident that no team made a better acquisition in the summer. Declan Rice, Mohamed Kudus, Cole Palmer and James Madison are all enjoying fantastic rookie seasons at their respective clubs. But Mac Allister is the best player in terms of value for money. Additionally, Klopp also referred to Mac Allister as a rhythm giver, a difference maker, and a football doctor since attempting to dub him Gary. Signing of the season is something he might as well put to the list now. Although last summer we all hailed McAllister as a steal, as Klopp rightly noted, he has fulfilled all of our expectations and more.